Hey, how's it going friends? My name is Angel Alex and welcome back to the channel and today you guys we are gonna be playing Mass Effect Andromeda. Now I'm not gonna lie, I have some mixed feelings about this. A lot of you guys uh, really weren't afraid to express how you feel about this game and I've heard many many opinions and there's a lot of mixed reviews about this game so I'm, I'm not sure how to feel about it. But currently, right now, I'm actually pretty excited. I mean, seeing just this menu screen has got me hyped, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, just jumping back into the Mass Effect universe has me excited. Now, this is my first time playing Mass Effect on PC, so just, you know, letting you guys know ahead of time, I'm probably gonna be a little bit slow with the controls, and if there's any issues, whether it be with my PC or the game, uh, hopefully we can get those all sorted out. But yeah, other than that, let's go ahead and jump right into this. Now we have Quick Start as Sarah Ryder, Quick Start as Scott Ryder, Customized Character, Multiplayer Settings, okay. Uh, I'd say, um, these are probably the default, like, Shepherds, right? So, maybe Customize Character? Hopefully this isn't for online? <laughs> but we'll see. Alright. Um, this is weird. I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty good. It looks a little bit, uh, better <laughs> than the, you know... When did this game come out, actually? Alright, so, I'm gonna go ahead and customize my character and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alrighty, you guys, so this is our character, um, just a little bit closer look for you guys. I went with the traditional purple eyes that I always do, and I try to get something similar to what I have now, although my hair is straight today. Um, they didn't have any haircuts with bangs, but it's cool, it's cool. Uh, the customization was actually a little odd, because you honestly, like, you can't pick your, your own eyes, and the only way to, like, kind of change your eyes is to change the preset or go to skin and like go to complexion and you just like kind of start cycling through like it's weird it's weird how much it changes so i couldn't even like pick my own eyes i couldn't pick my own mouth like i had to just like adjust how like thick it was and whatever but yeah this is our character uh we're gonna go ahead and move on to training choose a special training rider received in the milky way can i name my character i guess i can't um before joining the Andromeda Initiative. Okay. Training determines what power you'll have from the start and what skills you'll gain early access to. I'm leaning towards biotic already, you guys. <laughs> come on. I mean, come on. Although those throw 
Hmm. I don't see no Vanguard on here, bro. I don't know how I feel about this. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go Biotic here. Uh, I have to. There's no way. Like, it just- I can't. I cannot. Alright, so we got Biotic. Choose name. Here we go. Sarah Ryder. Let's not cho choose that. So our last name is Ryder. We're no longer Shepard. We are Ryder. So Alex... Although, we did Alex Shepard last time. Should I do Mia Ryder? That sounds so weird. Alex Angel- Angel Ryder? I guess we'll do Alex again. Alex Ryder. That sounds better than Mia Ryder. And then customize twin. Choose the default appearance for your twin or customize their look. That's a little weird. Okay. And all right, you guys, this is our twin. I'm not exactly sure what this is for, but yeah, this is him. Uh, if you guys want to get a little bit of a close-up, you know what I'm saying? Gave him the same colored eyes. Well, I think his are probably a little bit lighter than mine. Uh, let me see. Can't tell. Yeah, mine are a bit darker. All right, and then inherit Alec Rider appearance. Alec and Alex, that works. Uh, choose the appearance of your father. Uh, Alec Ryder. His appearance, his appearance can either adapt to your player's customization or remain as the default version. The option on Alex Ryder will be based on your character customized Ryder. Setting this off will use Alec Ryder's default appearance. Uh, I guess we'll just keep that on. I think that'd be kind of cool. Hopefully it doesn't- the dude doesn't come out ugly or anything because, you know, sometimes, like, those customization settings can be a little bit weird, but I'd say let's keep it the way, um, the way it is. Uh, Customize history, choose the gender of the legendary commander Shepard. Wow. 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 Well, yeah, we had a female Shepard. We had a female Shepard. That's right. Oh, God. Okay. I guess we're ready. Let's go ahead and go. Oof. This is weird. This is so weird, dude. I'm not sure how to feel about this. Every great moment in our history began with a dream. Each bold leap forward was achieved by those willing to do anything to attain it. We are, all of us, leaving behind families, homes, the very birthplace of our species. Some for discovery to see the unknown, others for a new start. But today, whatever our reasons, we take the first steps toward a new future for humanity. I'm digging the graphics, I'm not gonna lie. Today, we 
begin to make our dream reality. This looks pretty cool. When was this made? Because these graphics are great. I mean, it gives me it gives me excited for the next Mass Effect. Nearly losing a golden era of interstellar travel. Didn't they give us this? Yeah, they've, they didn't they say this in the beginning of Mass Effect One. Andromeda, Mass Effect. All right. I'm honestly very excited to play this, but a little bit bummed that a lot of you guys don't like it. So it makes me worried. 634 years later. From what? The Reapers? Is this- where does this take place? I, I have so many questions, guys. Where does this take place? What happened? What did Bioware do that made them, like, mess up? Why is this so bad? Why is this game so bad? Hyperion. Alliance. So many questions. Galaxy. All right. We made it. Deep breaths. You're gonna want to take good. it easy. This looks I've been good. taking it easy for 600 years. Rider, recon specialist, Pathfinder mission team. Pathfinder team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice, warm ocean, summer year-round? How about we get her a cup of coffee first? process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. Ryder, let's get you checked out. Look here. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates or golden worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of arcs arriving in Andromeda. Our new home for humanity. Makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? Oh, we're here. Uh, easy is no fun. It's what we trained for. Tone and choices help define writer's personality. Emotional, logical, casual, professional. Alright, easy is no fun. It's what we trained for. Um, so this is casual, although this is professional. Let's do casual. I hope not. Signed up for a little adventure before we settle down. Well, buckle up. Sounds like you'll get your wish. Yeah? Over here now, the Pathfinder wants you all on your feet right away. He said mission ready within the hour. Any idea why? No, but I'm guessing that's where your adventure comes in. Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before I send you on your way. Let's test your SAM implant. Sam, are you monitoring? Sam, are you online? Yes, Dr. Tapero. Good morning, Roger. We have a Jarvis. Well? My implant? Uh, yes, I'm excited. Still thawing. <laughs> I feel like a 600-year-old popsicle. I hope we packed more coffee. Readings confirmed. Based on the levels of adenosine in your system, the neural implant is functioning properly. Wait, adeno what? It just means you're still shaking off your nap. No reason why we can't get you on your way. Though you may want to hang around while we revive your brother. It always helps to see a familiar face. I don't like the sound of that. Oh, 
shit. Things are happening. What are we doing? Who's driving this thing? Honestly, gives me so excited for Mass Effect 4. I'm not gonna lie. When does this? Take this is Cora. Place? I'm at the cryo bay. Brace for a reset. This looks so good. Dude. Uh, everyone okay? I think so. What happened? We're not sure. Sensors are scrambled. But it's good to see you're up. Feels like centuries since we spoke. This is the Pathfinder. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, Riders, report to the bridge. You heard him. Let's get. Uh, we have a problem over here. It's Scott Ryder. Scott. Our brother's name is Scott. Hmm. What's wrong? I don't know. I don't know. Have to check it out. This is weird. I look so pissed off. <laughs> it looks like some sort of power surge hit Stasis Pod. Are they okay? I'm one. Ryder. Is my brother okay? Scott's fine. His vitals are strong, but the revival procedure was interrupted. I don't like the sound of that. Don't worry. It just means the process could take a bit longer than usual. Sam? My connection to Scott's implant was suspended. However, his pulse, respiration, and brain activity are all normal. To be on the safe side, we'll need to keep him in a low-level coma for a while. Then let his body regain consciousness naturally. He'll be fine. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Lexi. Keep us updated. This is the captain. I need damage. Right. I'll wait for you at the door whenever you're ready to go. All right. How do you want to handle this? Don't worry, Ryder. We'll take care of him. He'll make it. Okie dokie. Artichokey. Information wall. What is this? Hi there. I'm Gian Garson, founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I'm here to welcome you to a whole new galaxy. The good news is. The hard part's over. We're here. If you have any questions now, just ask. Okay. Your current location is Ark Hyperion, housing the human population. Ark Get some back backstory. Confirmed departure in 2185. The Asari ship Ark Lucinia confirmed departure that same year, as did the Turian Ark Natanis, embarking in 2185. Destination. The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates, or Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of ARCs arriving in Andromeda, our new home for humanity. Once the Pathfinder team's assessment is complete, Habitat 7 has been selected as the most likely candidate for colonization. Gotcha, I see Pathfinders. The Pathfinder is responsible for exploring and assessing new worlds for outpost placement and settlement. Each arc is led by a Pathfinder who represents their species. The active duty Pathfinder assigned to Arc Hyperion is Alec Ryder. Current duty roster shows you are assigned to the Pathfinder mission team, Specialist Ryder. Alright, mission status. At present, Arc Hyperion has arrived in the Helios Cluster. Further mission updates are offline due to technical difficulties. As recon specialist, you are tasked with supporting the authentication of Golden World sites through exploration, mapping, and scientific analysis. Currently, you are to report for duty on the command bridge. Okay. The Andromeda Initiative encompasses all colonization efforts, including arcs, pathfinders, outposts, and the central support hub, the Nexus. The current location of the Nexus is unknown. Status of outposts are unknown. Founder. I'm Gian Garson, founder of the initiative. I think it's important we take a moment to reflect on the principles that brought all of us together. It started with a vision of a better future. A vision that you shape. Life in Andromeda can be anything we dare to dream. And I'm proud to help make those dreams come true. Drop me a note sometime. I'd love to hear how we're doing. All right. Log off. Cool. Get some more backstory here. Who's this? It sounds amazing, doesn't it? 
We have the same right here. Up until you lose gravity. Cool, 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 cool. Is there anything over here that we could do? Still in stasis. Titles look good. Look at other people's pods. Sweet dreams. Shifts to run. Hey, we got a nice jog going here. Alright, I'm just looking around. Uh, we could probably head to that bridge now. Data pad. Through 600 of your voyage, good news is we're exactly where we're supposed to be. Year 20? I can't remember what year Mass Effect was in. The first Mass Effect. Okay. I still need an update on our sensor. Did the world just... Hey there! Hell of a wake-up call, huh? Didn't <laughs> expect that first thing out of stasis. Makes two of... Oh, Enjoy sorry. your nap, Ryder? Don't think I'll need sleep for the rest of my life. Well... Maybe another decade or two wouldn't have hurt. <laughs> right. Anymore. We'll talk to you later. The data pad. Welcome to your first day in Andromeda. Okay. So, the Andromeda initiative are the people that find planets so we can, you know, live on. And we, me, Alex Ryder, are the people heading to live there. Is that right? This or am I a part of the Andromeda Initiative? Gravity loss means something trip the generator. Am I one of the um what they say? Pa path keepers? Is that what they said? I don't know. Good to see you, Ryder. <sighs> uh, sorry, still waiting for some coffee. <laughs> it's cool, I feel that. Alright. Um let's keep going. You ready? Yep, yep, yep. Oh! What's happening? Hey, up here! Whatever hit the arc fried everything. We have to balance the power loader and explode. But we don't know where the fault is. Ryder could find it. She has a scanner. Quick, Ryder, use it to locate the fault. On it. I'll try to get readings on the second conduit. Hey, get on this. Down. I'll override the safeties. Got it. There's no indication of a fault in this component. Hurry! Keep looking! Relay 2C shows damage from a temperature spike. Found it! Bad relay! That's kind of cool. Can you go reset it? Sure. Just get me to do everything, you know. There! It's there reset! It Good job, Ryder. Now we can get to the tram. Let's go. <sighs> that was close. Barely in Andromeda and we're already scrambling. <laughs> the adventure begins. Not sure your dad will see it that way. Go ahead and take us to the bridge. Oh, okay. If you get out of my way, miss, I will gladly do that. Control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on reserves, Captain. They won't last. What's our position? Unknown. We lost telemetry. Sam, we need eyes out there. Attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be Pathfinder, but this is my ship. Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other Arcs, we proceed to our appointed Golden World. Solid ground. If it's even out there. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud. And that's just a wild guess what we hit. Alec, I need to assess the damage. Stop the bleeding. We've got 20,000 people asleep on this ship. 
Let's give them a chance to wake up. Can you blame her? It's her call. I prefer solid ground. It's her call. She is the captain. I think she gets the final word. Well, he might. This isn't about having the final word. Yes, sir. We're coming through. My god. Is that our golden world? That's Habitat 7. New Earth, if we're lucky. All of our long-range scans told us it was in the green zone. Perfect for human settlement. It doesn't even look the same. Can't give up, it looks bad. We don't know how bad it is yet. Still seems like it's our best shot. Maybe. There's always There's hope. just a lot on the line. Sam? The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Planetary conditions are on there. We're marooned. 20,000 souls adrift at sea. And when the power runs out and stays out, we need to know if that's safe harbor. And if it's not? As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. But if this goes well, we are already home. All right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet Fallen 30. Yes, sir. A stubborn one, isn't he? <laughs> he takes after me. Uh, he's not a people person. No one ever said Dad was a diplomat. People skills oh, so were that's our dad. I figured, because he had the same eye color as Just as, as long as he knows what he's doing. It's not like the cavalry's coming to save the day. I need an ETA on our sensor repairs. We're blind out here. Hmm. My brother's going to hate that he missed this. Are all the riders adrenaline junkies? I guess it's in our blood. <laughs> I was born a minute ahead of him. I never let him forget it. Don't worry. I'm sure Scott will pull through. Yeah, and when he does, he'll want to hear stories. So, let's get out there and find him one. Right, oh, right. you'll want to get your helmet. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. Gotcha, gotcha. As a member of the Pathfinder team, you play a critical role in the Andromeda Initiative efforts to establish a foothold in the new galaxy. Team face the team faces many challenges. The what? It's an old superstition of your dad's. Crashing the party, huh? Gonna suck. Oh, Ryder? My bad. Hey, Fisher, how's it going? I heard a rumor from the bridge Harper that your dad and the captain aren't seeing eye to eye on this. Uh, it's true. Don't believe rumors. I'll be honest with them. She wasn't thrilled with the idea of the expedition. My dad won her over. I heard you weren't a big fan of it either. It's her ship. Her call. You got guts going against the old man. The way I see it, Pathfinder team answers to the Pathfinder. <laughs> Besides, your dad's the N7 here. He's got the best aim. I go wherever he goes. Interesting. I'm learning a lot. Dad's rock. Good luck, rock, huh? <laughs> Your dad was mountain climbing back on Earth. It caught him from falling. The way things are going today, we'll need any luck we can get. Look at all these helmets, bro. Yeah. Got it. That should do it. The Pathfinder is now requiring sidearms. I've opened the armaments locker. Are we expecting trouble, Sam? A precaution. Please arm yourself, Ryder. Alright, let's get a gun. Better safe than sorry. You never know. Now let's get to the shuttles. We put this down a bit. Scanned Andromeda. Everything was in the clear. How could things change like that?
Dr. Carlyle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand, and if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. This could get rough, you and me both. If it's what we hope it is, it'll be one for the history books. You got a quote ready? One small step. <laughs> I'm pretty sure your dad will handle that honor. All right, team, button it up. We leave in five. Sir, we broke out the weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seems I love his armor. Given the situation, we'll be down a man with Scott out. I heard what happened. Your brother's strong. He'll make it. He better. Shouldn't worry. Uh, he better. He better. 600 year nap and he oversleeps. <laughs> you know him. Never was an early riser. Just don't let it get to you. I need you sharp. Yes, sir. <laughs> Your mom would have been proud of both of you. Okay, team, listen up. I chose each of you for the Pathfinder team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. We dream of exploring the unknown, of finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up, that Speech. we kept dreaming that Speech our first man. few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything they know. Here, here. We only get one chance to be first. So, let's go make history. To making it count. <laughs> Been waiting 600 years for this. I like the music. Unstable mass of dark energy. If you say so, steer clear of it. Gravity anomaly is detected. We're clear. Accelerating to cruising speed. This is sick. Dude. We didn't have a chance to be back in the Milky Way. Name's Liam Costa. Security Hello. response specialist. Good to meet you, Liam. Hard to believe we're finally doing this. Sure beats reading the brochures. <laughs> Beginning our deceleration. Planet's dead ahead. Woohoo! Here we go! This is cool. Oh, shit. Acceleration increasing. Oh, help. Go 
your jump jet is malfunctioning. Of course it is. Approaching terminal velocity. Sam! Oh, come on, I don't want to do it. Oh, shit. A Take little a bit. Rider. Sam's offline. Comlink's trashed. I'm surprised we aren't too. Uh, did that really happen? Any survivors? Did we really do that? Or are we dead and don't know it? <laughs> well, we found hell. I could tell you that much. Yeah. No way this is home. This is sick, Belle. Look at this. Looks like we're gonna find some high ground. See if anyone else is alive. Come on. All right. Look at Rider. this, you guys. How's your survival training? I've seen my share of troubles. Nothing crazy, but. Well, crazy just found us. Those rocks out there are floating. Terra incognita. <sighs> no fixing this. Must have broken on impact. Explains why we lost our sound connection. Oh, and safety tip? Don't breathe the air. Found <laughs> that out the hard way. <laughs> Got it. <clears throat> like, this looks so good. I'm not gonna lie. This looks so, I'm, I've said awesome it so many times already. This looks great. Sam said it's dark energy, but that's in space. Yeah, hell of a cloud. The cloud that makes boulders float. Oh, uh, what the hell is this? Oh, Come oh. On. We gotta get through it. Oh my. This is crazy. Welcome to Habitat 7. No. <laughs> Keep moving. Oh, well, shit. Careful, careful. Looks safer under there. Is this for real? What the hell is going on with this place? How's your gun? Might want to see if it's working. Take a shot at that fuel cell. It's busted anyway. All right. Test your weapon on damage control. Hold R. Look. Something flying around in the sky. Oh. I'd say it's working. <laughs> nice. Beat a holster. Gotcha. There! We get up that cliff, we find high ground. Come on! Oh, I'm not sure we want to be the tallest thing around here. Alright, coming, I'm coming. I think I can see a path up. We'll use the jump jets if we have to. Into the breach! I think I'd rather fall than get hit by lightning. Give it a minute. We can probably do both. <sighs> How'd my dad find you? I was a cop. Nice. Then crisis response. Yeah? Tell you over a beer sometime. This is gonna be close! Oh! <laughs> I forgot I could fucking hop. Oh no. I got it. I got it. Hops. Hops. There we go. That's it. We're getting there. Hops. Think I see the top. Hold space as you jump, you let you grab a push up. Nice. Alright. Mind making some room? <laughs> Got you, mate. Got you. Thanks. Look at my big what? ass forehead. What the hell is that?
I like the noise. Trouble. It's not a hotel, that's for sure. Nothing around here makes any sense. New galaxy, new ways to die. Just not today. Ryder, it's Fisher. Wait, look. Oh, what is that? Looks like Prothean. A little bit. No way, it's a Prothean. Oh, shit. What was first contact protocol again? No deadly force unless fired upon. <laughs> yeah, said no one in the field ever. How do we handle it? Uh, expect the worst. Follow protocol. Take it easy. We only get one shot at hello with these guys. Yeah, and Fisher gets shot in the head if we're wrong. All right. Okay, nice I and easy. We only go hot if we have to. Don't think they've spotted us yet. What's up with my hands? Why am I doing this with my hands? I don't know what to do with my hands. Shit. <laughs> they see Fisher. Uh, I, I don't understand. Well, what's the play? Please. Am I going up just like hands free? Hello. We can't understand you. Okay, we're doing we're this. We're not here to fight. That man's with us. Liar, shoot it. Oh doesn't god. It does not sound friendly at all. Oh. 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 Hey, hey, hey. Why did they kill you? Oh. Woof. Okay. It's over. Bishop, you okay? Uh, so much for making peace with the locals. <laughs> Thanks for jumping in. Uh, I didn't want to fight. I wish I didn't have to. The first aliens we meet and we try to kill each other? That wasn't the plan. Then we need a new one. Yeah, at least we know it's what. The brochures were light on aliens who want to shoot your head off. <sighs> we still don't even know what they wanted. The way they treated you? Blood samples, I'd say. Lots of them. This isn't how first contact was supposed to go. Or at least not how I imagined it. That's on them. Can't let it change us. Next time might go better. Yeah, the whole neighborhood can't be bad. <laughs> Where are the others? Gone. Kirkland and Greer went looking for help. Come on. Ah, my leg! Can you move? I think it's broken. You guys push ahead and look for the others. Oh, come sure. on, dude. Yeah. Just find us a ride out of here. And take a few more of them out while you're at it. <laughs> Okay. Icon Whoa. highlight optional. Take a look objectives. at these bodies. What are these things? All right. Scan the dead alien bodies. Search the shuttle wreckage. Well, I don't have Sam here, but I can try to make sense of it. They're DNA based, and their armor reads as some kind of bone. But the genetics are all over the map. Uh, mm. I guess life took a different turn here, huh? Scanning unknown technology and life forms earns you research data points. I hope Scan the other team's okay. Points on something. I we'll didn't find them, but we might want to scout around first. Oop, I'll take all that. You're the recon specialist. Point the way. <laughs> right. Escape. Look. Open the map. Oh, whoa. This is nice. We got a map. What is this? Journal. Plant side. Codex. Typical. Inventory. Oh no, this looks like Mass Effect 1. <laughs> Just very complicated. Helmet. Arms. We could change our armor, that's good. Consumables, research. This is very different. <laughs> okay, let's look at the map. Uh, here. Shot legend, toggle waypoint. Alien structure. Okay. We're going over here. Spent time with an Alliance peacekeeping force. All right, you guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode there. I know this is a little bit of a shorter first episode, but I'm not gonna lie, I was really busy today, and I'm honestly exhausted. And I wanna really get into this game when I'm fully awake. But with that being said, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't yet. Check out all the links down in the description if you're interested in any of the gear I use, and I'll see you guys in the next video.